In a sudden turnaround, Shiv Sena Supremo Bal Thakre this week decided to suspend the agitation against the scheduled India-Pakistan cricket matches. The Sena chief's surprise decision is considered to have been influenced by Union Home Minister L.K. Advani, who had flown down to Mumbai to talk to Mr. Thakre at the express wish of the Prime Minister, Mr. Atal Vihari Vajpayee. Shiv Sena's earlier threat not to allow Pakistan cricket team to play in India had been uniformly condemned. In fact, a survey conducted by the weekly news magazine Outlook, observers feel that this kind of public pressure could have also contributed to the Sena chief's climb down. The Sena leaders, however, refuted the argument. While the Home Minister L.K. Advani succeeded in persuading the Sena to roll back its agenda, his meeting with Bal Thakre came under attack from opposition parties. Earlier on January 18, 1999, suspected Shiv Sena activists had entered the offices of the Board of Control for Cricket in India, in Mumbai, and smashed the place, ostensibly to protest against the scheduled India-Pakistan cricket series. Following this attack, the BCCI decided to shift its offices to Calcutta. The attack on the BCCI office came in the aftermath of the digging of the pitch at the Feroz Shah Kotla grounds in Delhi by Sena activists. The incident at the Kotla ground had generated criticism, but the ransacking of the board office generated a heat that put even the critics of the tour on a back foot, because amidst the debris lay damaged many of the international trophies won by the Indian cricket team, including the 1983 Prudential World Cup. Sena leaders, however, categorically denied their involvement in the incident that took place in Mumbai.